assalamu alaikum everyone i'm back with another video and uh, today uh, we will be doing some more interesting thing so i would like to show uh, today i'll make a custom widget uh, uh, where we will be uh, updating uh, the questions and answers the feedback uh, in the background how to take the feedback from the front end and update in the background uh, so there is uh, one table which i have already created as q and a's uh, and th these are some questions which i have already added and uh, so my widget will be uh, the question will be already available to you and whatever answer the user will give over here it will get updated accordingly uh, so let's get started I'll give the name as uh, question answer I'll save it now I uh, will open in the editor So uh, before going to the HTML part, first uh, what I will do, I will write a server script from where I will get all the questions uh, and I will push it in the HTML. So where, let's take an object as QUES. So I need to take the question from the table, from this table okay so you underscore q a is the table name i'll uh, paste it here q u e s dot query uh, it depends like there is, if you want you can uh, create one more field as active or inactive and accordingly uh, okay I'll, I'll do that I'll create an another field here active or inact so that it will be better uh, for you because if you don't want some question then you can just make it inactive false take it as true false and uh, I will make this as active default value I'll make it as true okay so if you want you can make it false so I'll just add one query here q u e s dot add query u underscore active comma true only the uh, records which are true it will take those records while uh, QUES dot next now uh, I need a I need an object uh, where I will push all the questions which is already present in this table uh, so for that I need to take one data dot array I need to take an array dot questions equals to this okay now inside this I will create another object to push data QA object equals to this and QA object uh, dot q u e s uh, i have taken another variable q u e s is there and then this q u e s dot u underscore questions 
ओके यूंडर्स को क्वेश्चन यूंडर्स को क्वेश्चन इज द कॉलम नेम ऑफ द क्वेश्चन ओके आई विल ब्रिंग द कॉलम नेम हियर टू मेक यू गाइज अंडरस्टैंड Now, if you see, you wonder. So, question is the uh, name of the question. Okay, and uh, so I am taking this, and then I'll just uh, push in this question because uh, we know that the communication between a server and HTML goes with data dot. So, I'll push in this the object which I have created inside this. okay that's it uh, for server script now here what i will do is i will write uh, i will design the html part so i will write the class equals to form group make it as a green border focus now a uh, form name equals to i will def define this form in my css okay now uh, i will write up i will uh, take a para uh so that in each para one question will be there uh x is the variable and ng repeat works the same as for loop c dot data dot questions which i am pushing from uh server script data dot questions okay and inside i will write like something like this question colon so uh, double uh, open brackets two open brackets identify uh, the value okay so x dot q u a s because uh, in uh, we as we are pushing the object the object is containing q u a s as the variable name and in this variable name we are having the question so x dot this uh, let's see if it is coming or not okay now if you see it is coming like something like this why why it is coming blank because if the dot to string is important okay so if i give dot to string here and if i save see question is coming now okay now my next part will be question is available now next part will be to bring the answer and uh, uh, there will be one text box where you can just write the answer and according to this question the answer will uh, come here it will update in this table okay so guys you try uh, once and wait for my next video Uh, so that i will bring the answer uh, here like i will uh, try i will uh, i will help you with the text area and uh, how to update in the table thank you for today i have uh, made a short video so that you guys can try among uh, yourself first and then uh, wait for my next video thank you